So I wanted to take a second to give you my uh, tips for uh, tracing uh, this uh, pattern. So the first thing is the cellophane. Uh, once I've got the cellophane, I actually put some uh, masking tape on both sides, it, on both sides um, around all the edges so that it's, uh, first of all, easier to pin down onto this uh, Styro Mousse uh, cardboard that I purchased. And uh, so the, the, when you pin it down, the, the cellophane won't break and it's going to stay nice. The other thing is that I've actually uh, ensured that it was nicely stretched out before I put the uh, masking tape and then onto the second, uh, the other side so that it's also easier to move around. Now, uh, when tracing, uh, you see uh, one trick that uh, Louise mentions in her pattern is to use a blue marker when you're mar tracing your pattern onto your cellophane uh, so that you're sure that uh, if you see there's blue, you've actually marked it. If it's black, you haven't marked it yet. But I've noticed that um, a lot of uh, the technique uh, that's not said is uh, the way you trace it so that it's easier. First thing is that I actually put a napkin and I put my hand on the napkin so it, it glides easily. If you don't have it, with especially if it's in the summer and it's hot, you're, you're, you're going to be sticking to that cellophane. So just make sure that you have a napkin or a piece of fabric so you'll glide easily throughout. And make sure that when you're marking, if you're right-handed, you go from left to right and you don't go over because you see here, you're, you're going to get smudges everywhere. Uh, so here's my trick. Um, when I'm uh, tracing, I make sure that I don't block with my hands. I won't block. So I always need to see where I'm going with my line. So I'm going to go downward more so than upwards and uh, to to the right. Because again, if you're marking, um, if you're mar any, uh, you, you'll kind of notice when you will get the hang of it, you'll see, oh, I can't see where I'm drawing. So you need to stop and move uh, at that time. So you simply go and mark and you s nicely just smoothly go along and if you have your napkin it's really going to be easy to glide through that line through the line you do not um, remove your marker you simply uh, keep it down and it's your hand that's doing the all of the movement and so there it is it's a nice clean mark so those are my uh, quick trips tricks to uh, show you how to mark your pattern